Okay, we have a 1937 Ford frame. We just built a brake line set for. Starting at the passenger side rear wheel, we have our 9 inch Ford rear signature kit, which we've just test fit. We start with our brake line coming off the back of the bracket there, secured with an FHC01. Going to the center of the rear end, where we've mounted a FH06S flex hose on a RSBK09. Going up the hose, we're going to attach the other end of the hose with a weld-on bracket. Coming out the opposite side of the FH06S flex hose, we have the other side of the rear axle pair of brake lines going out to the opposite end of the rear end. Coming off the top of the flex hose, we have a quarter inch brake line that routes up to our PV01 adjustable proportioning valve. That uh, adjustable proportioning valve has two of our RSBB17 45 degree adapters. Those leave a 7 16 24 female port in the line. We'll follow that down to a RV02 residual valve, two pound. Uh, we've removed a fitting from one side, leaving a half 20 port for a brake line fitting. On the opposite side, we've changed out the fitting that was in the uh, residual valve. We removed it and inserted an RSBB14, which was necessary because the initial port was 3 8 24. This upgraded to 7 16 24. Follow that forward, we have our PV07 distribution block. Two lines coming out of the top there routed right over to our master cylinder. Out of the back, or out of the front port, I guess I should say, of the PV07, we have a half 20 port. Routes forward again to a RV02 residual valve. No modification was necessary to that. Routed forward again to an RSBB43 three way splitter block. That way we can route a line to the left front wheel and the right front wheel. This left front line loops underneath the frame, goes into our RSBK70 mounting bracket. Coming out of the front of the block, we run across to the right side of the frame, passenger side front wheel, where the line routes underneath the frame again into another RSBK70 bracket. 